And for the evening, you guys have been awesome so far. We're going to keep the show rolling. Um, Mom, who's coming up next? Y'all all right? Oh, you're ho the guy who put this all together, you guys. He just got back from the Memphis Comedy Festival out in Memphis. <laughs> Give it up for the motherfucking Mo Gray! I'm just glad y'all all came. It was looking kind of light at first. There was only eight people this morning that bought tickets. I was like, damn, I might have to sell a kidney or sell some bully pussies. <laughs> but y'all came, y'all made it. I'm out of breath. I'm the, I, I'm, the, I'm the host. I'm the promoter. I am the, one of the comedians. Like, I really know what it feels like to be Jamaican mixed with Mexican, is what I'm saying. I understand it totally, man. But I'm going to get right to it. Cause it's saying about me, it's about all the comedians, it's about you guys, man. We are dealing with a civil war right in this country. We're dealing with a civil war. The vexed versus the unvexed. The vexed versus the unvexed. It's like the 1990s Crips versus the Bloods. <laughs> because regardless of which side you choose to be on, unexpectedly, you might die. And this is my thing, like, I, I'm, I'm not vast or nothing like that, but I just need a little more time to get, like, some confidence before I make the choice to get the jab. Because the fastest vaccine in the past century took about 12 years to make. This one was developed in under a year. It takes longer to get a brown belt in karate. <laughs> Than to develop this life saving medicine, man. And we know brown belts don't fight that good, you know? <laughs> so I can understand why the vaccine is not doing too well. It's not that it, it sucks, it just needs a little bit more time in the dojo, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and they, they, they're trying to give us like different and like silly incentives to get the shot. They say most people that suffer from COVID, they're labeled as obese. Out of shape, but Krispy Kreme at one point was offering two donuts <laughs> to get the jab. It's like we're gonna cure you with COVID, but at the same time give you diabetes. That, that makes a lot of sense. And then they try to rope the brothers in too, right? Juvenile, the world famous Juvenile, had a song called "Back That Thing Up" back in 1999. He did a remix called. Vax that thing up. The premise was, if you want to smash these hoes, get that jab first. Nowhere in the song do they talk about condoms. <laughs> so you want to protect me from one thing, <laughs> they give me AIDS. That makes a lot of sense. That makes a whole, a whole lot of sense, man. And then Pfizer just uh, approved, uh, Pfizer just uh, got approved by the FDA. So a lot of people that's pushing the yeah, FDA just approved Pfizer. Take the shot, motherfucker. I'm like, well, the FDA at one point also approved Baconators, <laughs> Hennessy, <laughs> Fried Oreos, Johnson & Johnson's baby powder. All I'm saying is they don't always get the mark right. I just bought some Tenactin. Tenactin just got recalled, you know what I'm saying? Because I got my rewards card and they gave me the emails and shit like that. I probably got cancer in the groin, you know what I mean? At one point, the Tuskegee experiment was approved by the government. We saw what happened to those niggas. A lot of us are hesitant to Jab because it's just so much conflicting information from the same guy, God Fauci. It's like, first, you don't need a mask. Then it was like, I'm bullshitting, you do need a mask. No, I'm kidding, you need two masks. And then you need a shot with a mask. You need a second shot. You need a third shot. You need a booster shot. Oh, if you got the shot, you can't spread it. Oh, if you got the shot, you can't spread it. This shit is fucking confusing, man. It's more confusing than a six year old at McDonald's trying to order dinner for the first time. I want, 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 <laughs> Burger King, Jesus. <laughs> it's too 
too many things to remember, man. It's too many rules. It's too many changes. But I, I figured out a solution of how y'all can all properly remember the things that you have to do to keep up with this culture. shit. It came to me like in a dream, you know what I'm saying? Like a holiday song, 12 Days of Christmas, but the 12 Days of COVID. So I'm gonna close with this because it's kind of long. But after I'm done with this shit, you will know all the rules to stay safe and protected during these apocalyptic times. <clears throat> On the first day of COVID, Fauci told me, six feet, keep your hands clean. On the second day of COVID, Fauci told me, two weeks flat and curved, six feet, keep your hands clean. On the third day of COVID, Fauci told me, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curved, six feet, keep your hands clean. We have four. It's confusing. On the fourth day of COVID, Fauci told me, Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home. Two weeks flat and curve. Six feet, keep your hands clean. On the fifth day of COVID, Fauci told me, Pfizer approved by FDA. Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home. Two weeks flat and curve. And six feet, keep your hands clean. Six, right? <laughs> On the sixth day of COVID, Fauci told me two Moderna jabs, Pfizer approved by FDA. <laughs> Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curve, and six feet, keep your hands clean. On the seventh day of COVID, Fauci told me one Johnson Johnson, two Moderna jabs, Pfizer approved by FDA. <laughs> Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curve, and six feet, keep your hands clean. Yeah, um, oh, baby. Okay, okay, thank you. On the eighth day of COVID, Fauci told me, booster injections, one Johnson Johnson, two Moderna jabs, Pfizer approved by FDA. <laughs> yeah. Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curve, and six feet, keep your hands clean. Okay, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna help you, come on. Thank you. Thank you. On the ninth day of COVID, Fauci told me, weekly shots forever, booster injections, one Johnson Johnson, two Moderna jobs, Pfizer approved by the FDA. Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curve, and six feet, keep your head. Okay, just make sure y'all keep it up with me. We had, we had, you maybe fucked up the one man out of ten. We, had, okay. we almost done, we almost done. Y'all enjoy, enjoy this ride with me right now. On the tenth day of COVID, Fauci told me, if inoculated, you cannot spread it. Weekly shots forever, booster injections, one Johnson Johnson, two Moderna jabs, Pfizer approved by FDA. Double COVID mask, stay your ass at home, two weeks flat and curve, and six feet, keep your hands clean. Oh, y'all sound in the church, sound beautiful, man. We almost done. On the 11th day of COVID, Fauci told me, if you got the shot, you can still spread it. If inoculated, you cannot get it. Weekly shots forever. Booster injections. One Johnson Johnson. Two Moderna jabs. Pfizer approved by FDA. Double COVID mask. Stay your ass at home. Two weeks flat and curve. And six feet. Keep your hands clean. Oh, that's good. Man. Free clean works. It works, man. It's all good. Right. This is the last one. I'm out of breath. I'm about to die. The diabetes is on high speed right now. <laughs> I'm gonna get you this motherfucker. I'm, all, I'm about to take y'all to church. I just came from Memphis. I was just in Graceland. I stole something from Elvis's mansion. So I'm ready to do this shit for y'all, man. <laughs> on the 12th day of COVID, Fauci told me. What you say? Kids 5 through 12. Get the treatment. If you have a 
shot, you can still get it. If you're not delayed, you cannot spread it. Weekly shots forever. Booster injections. One Johnson Johnson. Two Moderna jabs. Pfizer approved.